In this video we'll see how to collect a simple random sample using the TI-84 graphing calculator. And we first need a population and do this uh, using a list of students on a roster similar to your application. And uh, here's the PDF. Uh, you can see me doing this with a spreadsheet in the other video. And uh, the first thing we need to do for a simple random sample is to number the individuals in the population. So you need a field or a list of all the individuals and then you want to number them. And so I'm going to number these individuals real quick. All right, now I've got the numbered list of all the individuals in the population. Um, now I need to get my sample. I'm going to use a sample size of four for this example. But whatever sample size is told in the directions, make sure you use that for the assignment. And I need to then pick four random numbers. And they need to be different numbers. I'm going to use the graphing calculator for this. And if we go to uh, math, the math button, and then go over to uh, probability submenu, um, you get the rand int function. The newer calculators have rand int no rep, which is good. If you have that, it'll avoid repeating numbers. If uh, we get repetitious numbers, we'll just throw them out. So uh, with the lower number it will be wherever we start the numbering, which is 1. The upper number uh, is with the last number, which is 23. Make sure you don't skip any numbers in your numbering. And then n is the sample size you want. Now, since I might get some repeated numbers, I'm going to go ahead and put in a 6. And I'm just going to pick the first four different numbers in, in the list. All right. So uh, notice that uh, 22 came up twice. So I'll use 7, 6, 22, and then my fourth one will be 1. And, and you see, if I only did a sample size 4, I might have just gotten three different numbers. So um, it's, if you don't have that no rep uh, function, then this one should uh, up the number and pick the first four different numbers. Okay, so 7, 6, 22, and 1. And we can go ahead and... Go ahead and write on this. So 1, and 6, and 7, and 22. Those are our four individuals. And then we would go ahead and list those names. Like that. And there's your sample of size four.